People in the Albuquerque foothills are on edge today after a shooting in their neighborhood yesterday led to two people killed and four others injured, including two APD officers. News 13's Annalisa Pardo talked to homeowners in the area whose neighborhood was blocked off for hours as the scene unfolded. She's live near Montgomery and Tramway. Well, we talked to about a dozen neighbors today. One telling us that the crime hitting so close to home made him scared for his daughter, who was coming home from school to a heavy police presence. That's the most unsettling thing is to have her um, experience these things and have the see of the fear on her face. That was uh, really unsettling, to say the most. Neighbors tell us many move to the foothills for the quiet and calm nature, and that a shooting like yesterday's was out of the norm. Tonight, there's a neighborhood meeting where APD plans to talk to residents about what happened. One neighbor we spoke with says she tried to call 911 when one of the victims was injured in their car near her driveway. That neighbor says she couldn't get through to anyone, and she's calling on city leaders to show up to tonight's meeting. It's gotten so bad, and um, and truly. The council members need to show up, the mayor needs to show up, the police are planning on showing up tonight. It's got to be um, a meeting where we come together and we maybe kickstart something new, um, not just for this neighborhood. Again, it, it goes for all of Albuquerque. There are still a lot of questions surrounding yesterday's shooting. What we do know is that police responded to the area around 2 yesterday afternoon. Police found a woman shot and injured in her car when they heard more gunfire that led them to another man shot and injured who drove himself to the hospital. Another woman was found dead in her car. Police found the suspect at this house and fatally shot him. Two police officers were injured in that crossfire. And now this is a house where officers uh, exchanged gunfire with the suspect. But it's unclear if the person living in the house is involved at all. 